Hey everybody, welcome to this tutorial or best practices really on using Google Meet and Google Classroom. Now a very excellent idea was brought forth on how we can use Google Meet and Google Classroom together and it's addressing a very serious issue within Google Meet itself and that is whenever you create a room that link lasts for a while it's a known issue Google has and apparently they're working on it so we'll see if things change here relatively soon but in the meantime this is probably going to be the best practice solution for using Google Meet and Classroom now the thing for that would be that when you have a Google Meet running okay we would grab the info there and of course we would want to post it within our classroom so if I post it there and my students have this link now the issue is that if the students always have that link they'll be able to jump back into that Google Meet and then they could be meeting off hours and that's just a situation we don't want to deal with so besides having a teacher stay in the room till every child logs off the thing would be that after this is posted and I'm posting it to my engineering class because I want to show you what's going to happen it would be to go in and then immediately after the class has ended delete the Google Meet link so they're not thinking about it and of course we're not telling our students that they can jump back into that Google Meet um, and then of course wanting to repost it so the best way to do that would be to then have it there and then set it up as a schedule post so we don't forget about it so maybe I want to post it tomorrow at the exact same time I could schedule that and then that will go out live before class the kids can jump on that link again it's going to be very important that we tell them specifically to check their Google Classroom for the Google Meet link and then they can jump into the Meet that way and then of course again when we're finished with it we delete that post it's probably going to be the best practice solution unless Google implements some sort of change before we as CCLS uh, would have to do this if other schools are watching and it's past that point I'm so sorry I hope you figured out some solution for it anyways if you have questions about this please feel free to reach out to me via email if you have my email from CCLS or you can always leave a comment underneath this video thanks for watching